Whew. Uh, whew. Um, sorry, I'm just trying to <coughs> catch my breath. Um, I am, it's halfway through my fifth week. I'm, I'm pretty new to Sydney, so I don't really know how everything's connected. So the school's in Menai. Um, so usually I, I ride to Cronulla, take the train and a bus, and then I get a ride back from the uh, station. I get a ride back to the station uh, from my mate, Zorba. But um, he isn't coming tonight. So this happened like last week, so I had to take an Uber. It took me like 20 bucks to get home from training. So I was like, oh mate, I'm gonna ride. Um, as you can see, the only road to Menai from Sutherland is like this freeway, uh, which is not very well lit. Um, and it's like 80 k's and pitch black for I would say 50% of it. Um, probably can't even see me as it's dark, but um, yeah, so that was probably you know, I've <laughs> done running with the bulls and lots of stuff. That is close to the one of the most dangerous things that I've done. So I am just going to shell out for an Uber from now on. I tried on the bike, but it is well and truly not worth it. Um, but yes, yeah, so I just thought I'd share that before I, I talk about what happened this week. Uh, and what I learned. All right, guys, see you later. Bye. So, on the way home from work today, I was like, you know what? It might be dark where I'm riding. Let me get a light so I can steal a line from Rainier Wolf Castle. The light. Still nothing. On pitch black highway, I could not see like one meter in front of me. If it had been like a brick or debris, I would have been a bit in a bit of trouble. Um, I might put up my my Strava speed to see how quick I was going down the hills. But yeah, this is uh, this is old faithful here. Gets me from A to B. Uh, I love it very much, but I'm not going to be riding to wrestling anymore. I'll take the bus and an Uber if I have to. If I can't get a ride. But yeah. Um, so I finished wrestling training quite late. Um, so I like to try and eat dinner before I get home because I get home which is at 10. <coughs> so on, on Mondays, I got myself a curry from the, uh, the curry shop just over there. But I, I don't want to spend too much money on food. So on Wednesdays, I have a bit of a grim dinner, uh, which I'll show you now. It's not as bad as banana sandwich, but it's pretty bad. So let me show you. John West, simply the best. Has anyone ever seen that John West ad? Maybe I cut to it now, because I, I always found it really funny. At the river mouth, the bears catch only the tastiest, most tender salmon. Which is exactly what we at John West want. John West endured the worst to bring you the best. Oh, baby. One day I'll make it to the big leagues and I'll have catering. Until now, Wednesday nights are tuna sandwiches. Uh, Friday on my fifth week. Um, and, you know, I've learned some, some cool stuff this week, so I thought I would share that with you. Um, and share some other stuff that happened this week as well, because it's been actually a pretty good week, to be completely honest with you. Um, so I learned how to give a suplex. And go. I take a suplex. Um, take a few other moves as well. Actually, a, a funny story which which made me feel really good actually in a funny way. But um, so some of the guys were were wanted to practice some some new moves, and someone wanted to do like Okada's um, neck breaker, back breaker sort of move. Um, maybe I'll cut to it so you guys can see what it is. Um, and so pretty much they were. 
we're at training and they're looking around and they said to me, uh, Ollie, you're light. Can we do this on you? And <laughs> that was the first time in my life that I've actually been called light, which, uh, which felt really good, even though they're about to, you know, do a, a crazy move on me that I had to take, but it was, uh, to be called light was, was pretty cool. Um, made me feel really good, made me feel like all this exercise and stuff that I'm doing is, is uh, paying off, which is awesome. Makes me feel, you know, great. <laughs> um, but yeah, so as well as that, as the suplexes, um, you know, being called light and taking those backbreaker moves, um, also learned some escapes. Um, some new escapes that'll add a bit more um, showmanship to the matches. Um, make it more in the sort of like luchador sort of style. So I like to learn different escape from the hammerlock and also the head scissors. So I might show you the head scissors now because it's probably my favourite things I learnt this week. Stop, stop, stop. 